Hi, I'm Dr. Andy Thompson, and I'm a rheumatologist. Today, I'm going to talk about celecoxib for the treatment of pain and arthritis. You can visit our website, www.rheuminfo.com, and print off one of our celecoxib picto pamphlets to follow along with this video. Celecoxib is also known as Celebrex. Now, celecoxib is a medication used to treat pain from arthritis. It's taken once or twice a day. Your doctor will discuss the right dose for you. Now, there are three things you need to do when taking celecoxib. First, keep an eye on your stomach. Celecoxib can irritate the stomach. Let your doctor know or seek medical attention if you have any stomach pain, nausea, or vomiting, if you notice heartburn or indigestion, if you develop black or bloody stools, or you're vomiting blood or coffee ground material. Second, don't take celecoxib if you have an allergy to ASA or an allergy to anti-inflammatory medications. And finally, don't take celecoxib with other NSAIDs and be careful using celecoxib if you're taking blood thinners like warfarin, which is also known as Coumadin. You should be careful using celecoxib if you have kidney problems. Please talk to your doctor. Celecoxib can cause an increase in your blood pressure. Your doctor will monitor this. Tell your doctor if you have high blood pressure. Celecoxib can cause swelling of the legs. It can also worsen a condition called congestive heart failure. Tell your doctor if you have congestive heart failure or if you develop leg swelling. Now, patients who've had a recent heart attack or stroke or experienced serious chest pain from heart disease should not take celecoxib. Celecoxib can also rarely cause a headache, dizziness, or an allergic skin reaction. And finally, celecoxib has not been properly studied in pregnancy. Let your doctor know if you're planning to get pregnant or if you're breastfeeding. Now, if you're taking celecoxib, you should call your doctor if you feel sick and want to stop. If you're concerned about any side effects or if you stopped or want to stop the medication for any reason. For celecoxib, there are other specific reasons to call your doctor. If you develop a rash, if you develop swelling of your legs, if you develop chest pain or shortness of breath, if you develop stomach pain, nausea, vomiting, black or bloody stools, or if you're pregnant or planning to get pregnant. I hope you found this video to be useful. For more information, please refer to our website at www.roominfo.com.